Okay, today, Hindi Conversational Connectors 3, we're looking at Iski Karan and Honiki Karan. The phrases Honiki Karan and Iski Karan are both used to express the cause or reason behind something. However, there's a slight difference in their usage. Honiki Karan. So, this phrase translates to due to or because of. It indicates the cause or reason for an action, event or a situation. It refers to a general cause or reason not directly connected to a specific noun or pronoun. Now, if you're like me, grammar terms generally just go straight over my head. So the best way I absorb things is by seeing lots of different examples. And that's what I'm going to do. So I'm going to mix the two examples up. Barish honiki karan. Hami piknik karna para. So due to the rain, we had to cancel the picnic. So we had to cancel the picnic due to the rain. Barish honiki karin hame picnic rod karna para. Usni meri kalam thordia. Uski karan me usi narazu. He broke my pen. And because of this, because of this reason, for this reason, I am angry with him. That's iski karan. For this reason, I am angry with him. Buri sarak. Halat honi ki karan. Traffic mein bohut tarava tha. So, because of the bad road conditions, there was a lot of traffic stoppages. So, buri sa- sarak halat. Bad road conditions. And due to the bad road conditions, there was a lot of traffic stoppages. So, honi ki karan. Due to this, there were lots of traffic stoppages. Mera bike ki karabi. Iski karan me kampa diri se pohuncha. So, because of my bike's breakdown, I reach work late. I reach work late because my, bro- my bike uh, broke down. Mera bike ki karabi. Iski karan me kampa diri se pohuncha. So uh, we have this word, savast, which means healthy. So asavast means unwell. So instead of using the word bimar for ill, asavast is being used here. Many asavast honiki karan kam parnahi jasaka. I couldn't go to work because I was unwell. Due to due to being unwell, I couldn't go to work. Pani ki kame honi ki karan. Peron ki stiti bohut karab ho rehi hai. Due to the lack of water, the conditions of the trees is getting very bad. So the reason the trees aren't, aren't good is due to the lack of water. So honi ki karan. Varish honiki karin hame baha jana chordia. Due to the rain, we decided not to go out. I don't know if you can hear it, but it was very warm in England today, and now it's pouring it down with rain, and you can probably hear it in the background. Varish honiki karin hame or hamne baha jana chordia. Due to the rain, we decided not to go out. Jab me chota tha, to me bohut sharab pita o dumrapan karata tha. Iski karan mera savaste karab ho gaya. So we had savast for health earlier. Savaste, healthy, like um, my condition. So I used to drink and smoke a lot when I was young, and due to this, my health deteriorated. Jab me chota tha, to me bohut sharab Pita or Dumrupan Karatata Iski Karan Mirasavasti Karab Hogea <laughs> Must have been prophetic this message because it's really pouring it down with rain now. Barish Honiki Karan Hame Bahajana Chordia. And this is a good example to use of uh, Honiki Karan in England when it's raining a lot. 
I hope these examples help you understand the usage of Honiki Karan and Iski Karan in sentences. Speak to you soon again. Be Malenge.